Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Crystal here and I wanted to go ahead and do a plan with me in my bullet journal. I'm pretty sure I'm going to go ahead and have music play playing as I'm actually planning but I wanted to show you basically what it is that I do. So I'm going to kind of share my process with you. really quick this is what this week's looks like and as you can see I just do a running to-do list I have a weekly to-do list and appointments in here as well I have weekly stickers that I like to use and these little dots here the pink ones are for my personal YouTube channel and the purple ones are for my planner YouTube channel and I did make a plan with me one this one I just didn't like how it came out so I'm gonna go ahead and retry it and I have been liking making it this way rather than a day per page or two day per pages and what I do is if I need to write poetry or any kind of journaling or anything like that I will just put it in the like behind it so if I had something to write I would just put it here put it here continue writing and then when I'm done I will do the next week and so on and so forth but I wanted to do this and my next plan with me will be my July monthly plan with me I don't want to do it right now because I'm not exactly sure if I will need to have any entries or anything like that I always do go over with pencil first and I use Crayola markers I made this and I thought it was super cute it says wink outside the box it's my play by Sephora thing and all I use, I believe this is a protractor and a gray Crayola marker. You can also use a mild liner if you want to, but I'm just using this one. So since I have four boxes, I have my little sticky note here to kind of tell me what's going on. I'm going to go ahead and just do what it is that I normally do. It is zoomed out quite a bit just because I move my planner around and I tend to get out of frame sometimes. I want to show you guys these stickers that have are, are going to be featured in my shop really soon. And they're just printed on simple matte paper, but I also have glossy paper. The glossy paper is going to be more expensive. Because it is really, really premium paper. I have been using this, as you guys can see. I've been using it, and it's been working out really nice for me. So I'm going to go ahead and just continue what I am doing. These are not offered yet because I always like to test them out. And as you can see, I did mess up on a few things here and like the little hearts so I they are still in a work in progress and also my personal size inserts should be coming up soon as well so I'm just going to get started on my planning montage.
right guys so that is pretty much it for this plan with me i know it is really 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 short i mean i know it's really 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 simple probably super short i'm not sure how it's going to be until after editing but i'm being 100 percent real i don't pre-fill in anything that i don't know is for sure going to happen i do any pre-planning in like my monthly area and stuff but so this is what last week turned out to be this is the week before and right here i kind of went a little overboard you know i put coffee cups i did this and that's kind of why i didn't like my plan with me because i normally don't add extra stickers until the day of so with that being said i didn't like this week but i loved this current week and of course i didn't film it so i wanted to do the same thing here and share with you guys i also have like editing filming and posting list here and thank you so 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 much ashley for sending me you know those stickers they're super cute i really do appreciate it and i sent you a little thank you card in the mail and that's pretty much it i hope you guys liked it if you did please give it a thumbs up if you have any questions comments or recommendations leave them down in the comments below and if you are wondering what's on my nails it is this one right here but let me say that nyc has one that's really really close to it and it's so much better but i did like it since it has like little bitty holographic glitters they're like super small but you can see them okay that's so off topic So yeah, I'm sure you can tell that I am more minimalist and I just like having some kind of structure but where I'm able to just write more. So like I said, if I don't have enough room here, I'm totally fine with just going to the next page and writing a full entire page on like let's say Monday and Tuesday if I need to and if I don't then I can stop on Monday and Tuesday and do the following week here. So. I hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't already checked out my bullet journal hacks, definitely check it out. And with that being said, I will see you guys next time. Bye.